What's going on? It's your boy Mo and today 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 man um we're gonna be making a mid-range shot. You know what I'm saying? Hold on. <laughs> Damn, my bad man, but coronavirus! We're gonna be making a mid-range shot. Um, we're gonna be using two different power charts, you know what I'm saying? So, we're gonna be making a mid range shot at the um, two and at the one with using all yellow and um, half yellow, half green, you know what I'm saying? So, let's get right into it though, bro. Enough of the talk, you know what I'm saying? Enough of the talking. As y'all see, bro, we got the same fit on, we grinding, putting in that work, okay? But look, though, we're gonna start off with the two, uh, hand we're gonna put right hand, you know what I'm saying? Jersey number number nine. You know what I'm saying number nine. Um, so what you want to do, bro? Uh, we're gonna use all yellow. Yeah, we're gonna use all yellow, and then um, for your physical, you want to pick all speed. So if you have anything else in mind, that's up to you. You know. But um, so what you want to do, bro? Uh, you want to max out your midi, max out your three point. You want to max out your free throw. Um, you want to max out your post fade. And yeah, you want to get the max shooting backs, right? So, I, you know what I'm saying? I, I actually got a, got a little build name for this. Don't get me wrong, it's still called the mid range shot, but it's just like this um, this little build I'm going to show you. I call it the balance one, you know what I'm saying? I call it the balance loadout, and I'm going to show you why. So, you want to get your pass accuracy to 81. So, when you're making this build, um, and you want to be called a mid range shot creator, your passing cannot go over 79. If your passing go over 79, um, you will be called a mid-range playmaker, or you, you ain't gonna be called a shot creator, but you're gonna be called a mid-range playmaker every time, you know. So, um, put your pass accuracy at 81, uh, ball handle, max it out, the post moves, max it out, and get 25. Take a little bit off. Well, actually, you know what? Um, we're gonna keep it like that just for now. Now, for the driving lay, you want to max out your driving lay and max out your driving dunk. Now, come back down. Max out your perimeter, your lat, steal, um, defensive rebound, block. Get your eight defensive batters. Then put the rest on the post moves. And then, yeah. You know, you, you really, um, for the balance one, you could though, 70. Then come back up and get you 70 right there. You know what I'm saying? Because why not? You feel me? Because it's just like. Hey, if we're gonna be called a mid-range shot, you know what I'm saying? Let me get that 70 post fade and the 70 post moves. Like putting those two together, you never know what you'll be able to do in the post. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, so 70 post move, and then you want to do 70 um, post fade, and then with the last the attribute, you can just put that anywhere. And this is the balance bit. Uh, this is the balance mid-range shot that I call. I just call it balance because like you, you got something in every category that's not bad. You know? I know you're probably thinking like, damn, why is you putting something in the driver though? The only reason why I put something in the driver dunk is because, um, you know, if we did have an open cut or just if we wanted to come inside the paint, even though we do got a bronze, we only got one bronze bad, having that driving, that 69 driving dunk, you'll be surprised. A 69 driving dunk with a high speed is actually a really nice combo, you know what I'm saying? And uh, you can't go wrong with it. So if you got nice little cuts, like I said, or if you got nice openings inside the paint, He'll finish, I promise you he will. He'll finish. So yeah, so you got 16, 25, and 8. So after you're done, you wanna go compact, 6-6. Six, six. Weight, you wanna go 180. Wayne Spain, you go 80.7. If you go over this, you'll be called a playmaker. You wanna go 80.7 for the wings, man. You'll take, you wanna pick shock array. Call the mirror range shot. You know what I'm saying? That, that name go crazy. I mess with it heavy. But I got another I got another little version of this build. So if you don't mess with that one, um, I got another one for you. You know what I'm saying? Your boy move got you. So let's go back. Let's go back. Um, If you didn't like having that driving dunk up and you just wanted to drive and lay, you know what I'm saying? You got to have something. Don't drop your driving lay down too much. You know what I'm saying? Because remember, we got the 80 driving lay. We got animation. So I ain't going to lie. I kept that high because we can't get bad. There's no way else anyway. So you know what I'm saying? So with this 35, I just brought it down here and got the max defensive badge, you know? So I call this one just like, this like the one with the most defense, so just whatever you want to call it, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, so that was the two versions that I had with this build. The balance one, which was, the balance one, which, uh, which had the uh, driving dunk, and then this one, which had the max defense, you know what I'm saying? So, 
uh, with the last like, attributes, I mean, you can put it anywhere you want. So you can put it back on the rebound or put it on your post move. Or, um, yeah, just put it like, you know what I'm saying, anywhere that you had a man. You know? Anywhere you had a man. Uh, body shape, put it compact. Your height, put it 6'6. Six, six. Um, for your weight, I'm gonna make them 6'6. Six, six. I mean, no, damn, my bad, y'all. Kids out right now, man. Uh, but for your weight, you want to make them 180. You know what I'm saying? The kid be making vids all the damn day. Be able for the weight, you want to make them 180. And then uh, for the wingspan, um, you want to do 80.7. If you go over, remember, you will be called a playmaker. You know? So, you'll take, you want to pick shot rate. And, yeah, what you call, bro? A mid range shot. You know? So, we're going to also do another variant of this build. So, if you wanted to run the one with this build, it's not bad, it's the same thing. But what I don't like about the, uh, this mid-range shocker that the one that's 6'6", six, six, uh, you lose badges, you know. So I'll show y'all what I mean. So, right, well, you only lose one badge, that's it. But, you know what I'm I like having all my badges, you know. And that's really the only downside to the mid-range shot at the one. You you just lose a badge. That's the only thing. The two is the one that got the that got the um, the extra badge. This one don't got the extra badge. So, you want to pick pretty playmaker again, all yellow. And then you want to pick off speed. If you had anything else in mind, that's up to you, my boy. That's up to you. So, you want to max out your driving lay, max out the uh, driving dunk, and then max out the midi, the three point, free throw, post fade. And I'm going to show y'all, right? So, we're going to try to get 16. Try to get 16, max out the pass accuracy, max out the ball handling. I don't know why I keep doing that, but you want to lower that. It just put it at 81 again, because like I said, if you try to put your pass accuracy over 79, you will be called a mid-range play, you know? So, keep that at 81, then you want to come down with the rest of your attributes. Max out the perimeter, the lat, steal, defensive rebound, block, and then try to get your 8. But, as you can see, when we try to get the 8, we short. You know what I'm saying? We short, man. And, um... You know you can you can't. Well, it ain't really short. I said that you short a badge, but as you can see, when we ran the two, and we did the balance one, we had eight twenty five sixteen. You know, with the seventy, with the sixty nine driving dunk. You know what I'm saying? This one you did twenty four. So if you want to get them badges, you know what I'm saying? So I mean, if you want to get your active playmaking badge, or just even hey, eight, if twenty four was cool with you, you know what I'm saying? That's not bad. But me personally, though, bro, I need my own. I need 25, so I dropped it down with this building, just got 15, and then um, brought it back down here and got 25, you know, just left it like that, 15, 25, and 8, you know what I'm saying, so we're going to make them right quick, compact, 6'6", six, six, and then um, you're going to go 180, wingspan 80.7, it's the same thing we got the 1, if you try to go over 80.7, you will be called a, um, you'll be called a playmaker. You know, so you want to pick 80.7 for your wings, man. And also, I, I forgot to mention, no matter where you're making this build, the mirror and shock rate at the two or at the one, um, it don't matter what you do, though, with the wings, man. You can go short and you can still be called a mirror and shot, but um, I would recommend you having short arms. You know, 80.7 is a nice all around wingspan uh, length, you know. So, wingspan, you want to go 80.7, and then uh, for your take, you want to go shock rate. Now, it say you got a, um, a mid-range shot creator. Bam. So, we got the mid-range shot creator at the one. You know, so let's go back and edit them right quick. Let's go back and edit them. And, yup. So, this is the uh, this is the balance. Um, this is the balance mid-range shot. The one that I showed y'all that just got, like, some in every category. But, if you didn't want that one, like I said, you can always drop that drive and dunk. Um, bring it back down, then max this out and get 16. Max that out. But as you can see, when you try to max out, when you try to max out, um, you know what I'm saying, like everything how we did, how, how we did the mirror and shot at the two, we got 10, 25, and 16. With this one, sure. So if you did want to get that, you'll probably have to uh, drop, the, drop the playmaker down, probably like 24. You know what I'm saying? Then get to 25. I mean, get your, then get your 10 down here. And then you have to do it like that. So it's just basically like when you at the one, and you were trying to make a mirror and shot, when you at the one, you always going to be short of bags, you know? 
But not bad, bro. You just saw the bad. That's it. You know, you just saw it one bad. You, know you can always work around that. If you really wanted to run the two. I mean, if you really want the one, the, uh, one with the two, you know. So your wings, man. You want to pick eighty point seven. Then for your tape, you want to pick shock rating. And after that, we done. What you call move? We call the mid range shot. You know, we call the mid range shot. So let's go back to the main menu, bro. So. As y'all saw right there, so we made the mid-range too. I mean, we made the mid-range shot creator with all yellow, right? So I'm gonna show y'all how to make um, a mid-range uh, shot creator at the one and at the well, yeah, at the one and at the two, right? That can speed boost, you know what I'm saying? But this one got green in it, you know. So we're gonna start at the two. We're gonna make them right-handed. Jersey number number nine, number nine, number nine. So yeah, so we're gonna pick number nine, and then. For our pack chart, we're gonna choose half yellow and half green. So after you choose half yellow and half green for your physicals, um you wanna pick all speed. Now after you pick all speed, let's get right into it. So we at the two right now, um max out the driving leg, max out the driving dunk, um, max out the midi, three point, free throw, uh post fade. You know, so you can just max out everything. We gotta come back to it. So yeah, you gotta drop this down. Remember your pass uh, accuracy. It can't be over. Um, your pass accuracy can't be over 79. And we put it at 82 because you know your height messes with your um, your pass accuracy. You know. But I think for this one, we gotta put it exactly at 79. You know what I'm saying? So ball handling up there. That's up there. Perimeter, get that up. Lateral, make get that up. Sink this up. Get your block up. But if we look at it, we can't really touch nothing else. You know what I'm saying? I mean, of course, we got a job at three point to be called a mirror and shot. But, um, you know, we still missing some attributes. You know what I'm saying? We need some more attributes. So if we look anywhere else, we can't take none off the playmaker because we already got 19. So we're going to have to come up with this build and drop your driving down. Now, with this, um, with this uh, mirror and shot credit at the one, I ain't even gonna lie to you. I don't have like no, you know what I'm saying? You, as you saw with the per play make, we had the little balance load out, the little balance load out. I was saying, and then we had the um one that had max defense. With this one, I ain't have no driving dunk. With this one, they got half yellow and half green. You know what I'm saying? Um, with this one, we just had a driving leg, no driving dunk. You know, so you want to come down, max out your block, max out the interior, and then you want to get ten for the defense. And then yeah man you want to leave it exactly like that and really when you look at them you can't really get no better than that so you want to go compact you want to go six five now uh i got two uh like height changes with this build so when you making this build man um six five or six four right so we have the two right now right so i mean if you did want to run a two guard with this build um I want to go 6'4 with a, with a 2, that's too short, but 6'4, I mean 6'5 is more ideal, you know what I'm saying? So, you go 6'5, and then for your weight, drop it all the way, and then for your wingspan, you want to drop it, I mean, you know, you want to um, drop it until you can get pro dribble moves, and then as you can see, my 3-pointer is still at 81, you know what I'm saying? If you want to be caught a mirror and shot, your 3-pointer has to be exactly at a 79. So, we got to go back, drop the attribute down, just one. Drop it down one, compact, six five. Wait, 175. Keep dropping it. We gotta drop. Gotta drop one more, one more. We also drop one more. Put those little attributes wherever you wanna put them. You know what I'm saying? Feel weight. We're gonna put it 175. Feel wings, man. Drop it till you get pro drill mode. Now you can see we got the 92. Mid range, and also we have a uh, we have a three point. I mean, we have a 79 three point. Now, you know what I'm saying? So, I'm gonna put his wingspan right there and pick whatever take you want it. You know, pick whatever take you want it. And then, after that, we got a mid range shot. You know, so and also, I want to talk about this bill. Um, this bill is actually not bad because it's like, yeah, even though, yeah, we can't speed boost with this bill. It's not bad because we running the two, not the one. So we're gonna be inside and out. For, so for us just having those pro dribble moves, we can still facilitate and work around the court really good. You know what I'm saying? With that 85 
uh, ball control, you know what I'm saying? And also, if we did go over 86, I mean, if, I mean, if we did hit 96, you know what I'm saying, you could still um, speed your boost, you know? You would just have to stay at a 96, which is not bad. But if you're a guard and you did want to speed boost off rip, I re highly recommend you to just come back, right? You want to come back and just make a point guard now. And also, I wanted to mention one thing. Um, the 6'5 and the 6'4, um, like, they they the same. It's just the 6'5, you just speed boost later. 6'4, it's more for a person who just want to run and run all the time and just want to speed boost on rip. You know what I'm saying? So, for your position, you want to make them at the 1, make them right-handed, go number, make them number 9, make them number 9, you want to continue, and then for your... Um, patch chart, it's still the same thing. You feel me? Have yellow, have green. Don't wait. We missed it. Yeah, damn. Yeah, have yellow, have green. So, we're gonna pick out speed. Max out that drive and lay. Don't touch the dunk. Max out the midi. Three point free throw. Post fade. Knock this down to a seventy. No, drop it. No, knock it down to seventy nine. Pass accuracy, you gotta drop it down to a to a 81. Ball handle, post move. Um, let's see. Yep, post move. That's on the perimeter. Lack, steal. Defensive rebound, block. Max out the interior. Put these last attributes to whatever you wanted to. You know what I'm saying? And then after you finish, well, also I, I forgot to mention one thing. So when you do make this build at the two, um, you get an extra badge. You know what I'm saying? You get an extra badge, which is not bad. You know what I'm saying? When you at the two, you get an extra badge. When you at the one, um, you get 24, 19, and uh, nine. You know, so it, it's not bad, not bad. So after you're done with them, you know what I'm saying? We look at everything else. We look, we need to see if we need to change anything else. Everything is good. That's all you can get. You know what I'm saying? You can't uh, get ten defensive badges with this build. I mean, if you did want to get ten defensive, ten defensive badges with this build, you could. You could just do 19 for the playmaking, and then come back down. You know just keep dropping the playmaking until you can get your ten. And once you get ten, come back up. Put the post move to where you need to. So, man, you look at it. You got 24, 19, and 10. You know what I'm saying? You got 24, 19, and 10. So, after you're done, you want to hit compact. You want to hit 6 four. You want to drop your weight low as possible. Your wingspan. You want to drop it to where you can speed boost. So, it looks like we got to drop one off the three-point. Boom. Bring it back. Compact. 6 four. 175. The wingspan, drop it to where you can speed boost, and you're done. 78.7, you got shot take, but what's the build gonna be called? He gonna be called a mid-range shot. Now, we just made one error with the build, and that's basically just because it's just trial and error, you know what I'm saying? Like, you gotta just make sure that your, um, that your pass accuracy not up too high. You know what I'm saying, because as you can see, uh, they gave us probably they gave us like an 80 pass act. So we gotta just drop it down. One compact six fold. Last we gotta drop it down again because as you can see we our pads actually still have. So we gotta drop it down again. And we got 18 for playmaking. We made another little minor little error. We made one minor error. Just gonna do this build. You gotta make sure you got 19 for the playmaking. You know what I'm saying? Can't do 18. 18, that's a no-no. 18, that's a no-no. So, come back up top. Just have 19 for the playmaking. You know I'm saying? I'll leave it right there. You know what I'm saying? So, you want to get 19. If you did want to get 20 and then get the 10 defensive batters, you could. But me, though, bro, I need that uh, I need that 19. You know what I'm saying? But it's uh, all up to you and it's all how you want to play with this build. You know? All how you want to play with them, but I, well, once we're done, you want to pick compact for the body shape, uh, for the height, you want to pick 6'4 for the weight, you want to pick 175, and for the wingspan, just drop it to where you can speed boost. 
As you can see, our pass accuracy is now at a 79, and our three pointers at a 79. We got both thresholds to where they need to be. If my three pointer was over 79, I'll be called a shot creator, and if my uh, pass accuracy was over a 80, I'll be called a mirror range playmaker. You know, but drop it to where you can speed boost, shot creating tape. After we're done, you call it a mid range shot. You can't get no better than that. You know what I'm saying? Can't get no better than that. So, yeah, though, man, I hope y'all enjoyed the video. If it was anything the kid could have did better, just let me know in the comment section below. If you need any help or tips, or you had questions about this video, just let me know. Your boy is active and I'm watching. I'm watching the comments all the time. You know what I'm saying? So hit the kid up if you had any questions. You know what I'm saying? On the YouTube comments, uh, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, your choice. You know? But Lil Yaro, bro, make sure make sure y'all catch me on the next video. But the kid Mudo, man, I'm going to be signing out, man. I'm going to be catching y'all on the next video. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to catch y'all later, man.